My name is Bianca and I am a Sephora addict. Hey girl, hey, welcome back to my channel here at BCDD TV. We talk about anything and everything relating to beauty and lifestyle. If that sounds like something you're interested in, make sure that you hit the subscribe button and just keep on watching. And if you're not new here, hey girl, welcome back. So usually I don't post videos back to back, but in this case, we're doing it a little differently. So you guys should have already seen my Sephora haul from the BIB sale today. Well, technically when you see this, it'll be yesterday. It's the same day for me. And your girl went back to Sephora and blew another bag. We went and got more things, y'all. I was supposed to only go back and get the spray to the candle that I bought. That was a whole mistake. If you don't know what I'm talking about, stop right here. Go watch my first haul, then come back and watch this one. Y'all, Sephora just be getting me. They be getting me. Not getting, they got me. They, they got me. Anywho, I'm going to make this video really quick. I just wanted to come back and show you guys my part two of the VIB sale and show y'all what else I found today. So we're just going to jump right into it. All right, for this, I'm going to, this is not as organized as the video you guys seen prior. So I'm just going to pull stuff out of the bag. And I do have the receipt here, so I will do what I did in regards to showing you guys the original price and then what I got with my discount. So we'll start with these. I got these Cairo, I don't know if I'm pronouncing this right, I'm gonna say Cairo Rubber Face Mask and I got the one with Moisturizing Hyaluronic Acid because I love Hyaluronic Acid. So this is the mask. Um, shout out to my girl Cairo Amonique because that's where I got it from. Never seen these before in Sephora until today. Clearly they've been there, I just haven't seen them. Um, and we're gonna try it out. I got two because Rob be acting like all of a sudden he cared about skincare when I started doing my, you know, detailed steaming of the face and the face mask. Then he'd be looking at me like, what about me? So I got him one. So we're gonna try it. Um, you guys will probably see that in a weekend vlog, but, or I think I have a spa day video coming up, like my intense spa day from start to finish, which are usually on Sundays, more like a self care day. Um, comment down below if you guys want to see that. Let me know. Next, I'm really excited about these two. Okay, so if you watch YouTubers, y'all seen this before, I'm sure. I finally decided to get the Necessaire Body Wash and Body Serum. So these are the boxes that it comes in. Um, I'll actually take it out for you guys, but I'm sure, like I said, if y'all watch YouTube, I'm sure y'all seen it before. But if not, let me just be the first to show you. So I got the one with eucalyptus scent in it. And this is what it looks like. So this is the body wash. I've only heard great things, so I'm excited. And even when I purchased it in the store, the ladies in the store were so excited for me. They're like, oh my God, you're gonna die. Like, you're gonna love it. So I'm like, wow. I also got the serum. Um, they do have a body lotion and a and something else, an exfoliant. I'm really picky about my lotions and my exfoliants because I have eczema and dry skin and I just wanna stick to what my body already knows. But I do wanna try the body wash and the serum, I think if anything would help with my dryness. So we got this too. And this is not eucalyptus scented, it's actually fragrance free, my favorite, when it comes to moisturizers and such. So, I'm super excited about this. Um, like I said, I may add this to my spa day routine. So if you guys want to see that video, definitely let me know in the comments so that I can make that happen for you guys. So the body wash was $25. So I got it for $21.25. And then the serum is $45. And I got it for $38.25. Wow, that's kind of pricey. Well, so now you guys know. Next, what did I get? Next, I got 
a oh so i just got a sephora like a face mask applicator because i've been looking for one of these so i just figured let me get it so i don't know if you guys could see it but basically it has a flat end on one side where you would put the your mask on your face then the other side has like a silicone brush type of material i don't really know Oh, I guess that's used to gently massage and remove it. Hmm. The, flexi the flexible silicone bristle and gently massages and helps to remove products from the skin. So that's what the brush size is for. So that's cool. And like I told you guys in yesterday's video, um, anything in the Sephora collection is 30% off. So this usually sells for $10 and I got it for $7. Love a deal, love a deal. Next, I got, oh, Anastasia Beverly Hills, The Brow Wiz. I live by this. <clears throat> Excuse me. I live by this product. I've been, first of all, I've been obsessed with my brows since high school. I've been, I've been doing the brows, okay? The brows ain't nothing new. We, we've been here before, for some time now. Okay, so I've probably been using this since like 2011, 2012. Yep. And just so you guys know, I get the shade Dark Brown. I live by this product. The Brow Wiz is the only, I've literally only used this. That's it and nothing else, okay? Nothing else. Everybody always asks me, oh, your brows are so nice. What do you use? What do you use? Here you go. Routine coming soon, but until then, here you go. Here you go and buy you a few. Usually my mother and I, we buy like three at a time each because your brows just make your face chow. Get you one. And the Brow Wiz sells for $23. I got it for $19.55. So if you're someone like me that buys it three at a time, that's an amazing deal versus buying it one at a time. Get it on the sale, get you a few, call it a day. Do, do, do. Next, we got Chow. Oh, let me tell you about this. So I've been trying to come to terms with myself that buying a lip gloss for $35 should be a thing it shouldn't be a thing but because it was on sale i decided to make it a thing i went ahead and got the dior attic lip glow oil i'm sure y'all know about this it's everywhere they've been selling like hot cakes my store had three clear ones left that was my sign to get it because every time i've been there i've just been like like i said i've been trying to make myself think it's okay to spend 35 dollars on a lip gloss when the beauty supply lip gloss lip gloss do just fine honestly but Y'all know, again, if y'all have not seen my Ulta haul, go check that out. I wear the lip oil from Morphe. Amazing. But every time I go into Sephora, I, you know, with the tester, trying to make myself come to terms with spending that on a lip gloss, and they never have it. It's always just the testers laying there. Today, there were three. I said, oh, God, is that you? <laughs> is that you? It must have been him, so I got it. Ciao. We gonna see, it better be worth every dollar. So like I said, it goes for $35. I got it for $29.75. That's still absurd. I don't approve this message, but. So the last two things I got were perfumes. So like I told you guys, the initial reason why I went back was to get the perfume to the candle that I accidentally bought. So I did go ahead, they didn't have the full size of the Mar Mason Margiela bubble bath, replica bubble bath, but they did have the the mini size, so like the roller. So I decided to get this because I'm actually not heavily in love with the scent. I kinda like it. So I was like, let me just get this one. And if I fall in love with it, then I'll purchase the spray. And like I said, they didn't have the spray. It's actually sold out on Sephora website. So it wasn't like even an option. So I got this one and then, y'all the seven virtues is that what it's called yeah the seven virtues i got the vanilla woods now y'all know i love vanilla y'all know i love vanilla and i'm gonna shout out to kyra amanique again because she she didn't post this one she posted vanilla vanilla something so that's when i went in to smell they didn't have it the girl told me it was more of a muskier scent which makes sense because if you watch her channel she's into musky scents i'm not really into musky scents 
So she said, why don't you try this one? It has so much of a sweeter scent. Y'all. Mmm. Matter of fact, I don't even have no perfume on right now. Mmm. Mm. I could drown myself in this. Y'all hear me? Drown. If you like, and it's not, the thing with vanilla is it could come off very immature and childish. So it's very hard finding mature vanilla scents. Very difficult. The wait is over. The wait is over. Go get you one. Um, they didn't have this in the full scent either and it was also sold out on their website. When this comes in stock, I already I have the notify me available. Sale or no sale, I'm buying it, the full size. And then I'll just keep this like in my bag or when I'm traveling. This is the type of scent that I need to have on me at all times. So, expect that to go with all the rest of my favorite fragrances over there. But um, yeah, I love this scent. So the, the replica bubble bath, the small one cost $32. I got it for $27.20. And then the Seven Virtues Vanilla Woods runs $30 and I got it for $25.50. I almost want to go back and get one more of these. Because I'm the type, when I really like something, I always want it. So I like one in my bag, one in my car, and then the full size in my house. Because you just never know, you know? Um, stay tuned on that. I might go back and get another one. Is that it? That's it. So I wanted to keep this video very, very short and simple and sweet. Now I'm physically done. Anything else that I buy from the sale between today and tomorrow is gonna be like doubles of stuff, but I'm, I'm done. I promise I'm done. I am done. They took all my money, I'm done. But I hope you guys like this video. Like I said in the last video, comment down below if there's anything in this video that you guys seen that you're like, oh shoot, I gotta go grab that. Because I'm telling you, I think these pickups was fake better than yesterday's pickups. Like yesterday's pickups were everything that I've already had in my cart. These were like, I wasn't even thinking about these, but I'm happy I got every single thing. So comment down below what y'all got for the final pickups because the sale is about to be over. Do not miss out. Like always, love you guys. Make sure you hit the post notification button so you don't miss another upload because I know I did two uploads, which is not really in the schedule, but I didn't post two videos last week. So I think this makes up for it. I think this makes up for it. So I will see you guys on Tuesday. Bye.